Okay, welcome back everyone, Questine here with more Phoenix Point. I am going to head over with my uh, ships, well, my manticores, at different locations. The research will be over, will be ready soon enough. I really do wonder, is there any base in, uh, in Europe? Nope. Then, okay. Until now, we believe the Pandora virus to be a large DNA virus that rapidly mutates any living. Okay. Incorporating. Okay. Many suspected. So the Pandoran are analysis incorporating new data from the cryogenic facility, the Chinese sinkhole, and the Siberian lab confirms three facts with the war with worrying implications. It existed on Earth long before the current outbreak. The Pandoran virus is non-terrestrial in origin. The Pandoran virus is the product of design, not evolution. There had always been rumors that maybe the Pandora virus wasn't from Earth. That some alien disease had come down from the stars, like a plague from heaven. But now that we finally had the evidence we needed, we realized the truth was more terrible than that. The Pandora virus was alien, yes, but it wasn't a disease. It was a bioweapon. We were not alone. And whatever was out there wanted us dead. None of this had deterred Randolph Symes. He continued his quest, hoping that whatever his great-grandfather had buried in Oglethorpe University's time vault held the answers he needed. We would have to hope that he was right. All right. We need to get that time vault. The Pandora on our bases. Okay. <laughs> so New Jericho is pissed at both of them. Rightly so. Okay. We need, uh. <laughs> Okay, I need to check my guys, give some ammo. I'm going to start running out of resources at this particular rate. Oh, I think I've made some, uh, yes. I get rid of that one. There we go. We got a laser assault rifle ready to go. How about that? Do I think that these guys can handle themselves? Probably so. Well, you know what? I'm going to take a risk here. Well, he does have a machine gun. What the fuck am I doing here anyway? Yeah, how about that? Take Use the fucking machine gun because it's actually going to do quite a reasonable enough job. Tiny, okay. Yeah, you are not going, David uh, Pancho. I'm going to take Zach hologram. Though, first, I do need to check some stuff. Yeah, that will do. That's fine. Okay. Yeah. Say. Do I want both of these guys? Eh, probably not, really. Because someone does... Uh... Yeah, there we go. 
All right, hold on. Yeah, yeah, good. Okay. Yeah, she's not going there. Gunswarm is, Shepherd is basically, let's go. The assault rifles have ended up being the biggest weakness. Now, I can produce some. Sinedrion has given me the technology to do so. And I do want to help New, help New Jericho here and then maybe deal with the Pandoran Lair. Or maybe go for the university, whatever might be in there. So, the Pandora virus is a biological weapon by a Franks to an alien race. There's also obviously more research to be found over here. So Sinedrion is not going to appreciate me helping New Jericho, but then again, I don't give a fuck what they care about right now. Besides, for every... Okay, so we got this guy, we got two of these guys. What are they? Uh, okay, so we got Goo. Ooh. We got two Kairans with Goo. Five by five. Alright, so you... I should have probably switched her weapon around. Let's go. Anyway. That's a bit too far, isn't it? Hmm. Let's try. He's got the machine gun. It's not enough, unfortunately. Ralph Goonswarm, okay. You might be set. Hold on. Let me just move her. Gotta keep going. Now I can't just sit sit on my ass. Okay, good. How much damage are we talking about? Fuck all, basically. Because of course the laser weapons of the fucking greens are completely bloody useless. <laughs> Uh, just a joke, really. Um, we got to keep going. I'm on my way. Alright, going to fire... No, he needs to get closer, considerably closer, to be able to fire that grenade launcher. On it. Okay, that will do. There's an enemy there. Only one got hit. Acquiring target. No, you are not moving just yet. Online. Hold on. Yeah, we got line of sight. Hold on, I'm trying to figure out where I'd... Yeah, there we go. I don't want to eliminate that one. Because you never know how this is going to go down. So it seems like a reasonable enough uh, idea. Okay, sh he should be able to finish. Nope! Right, Tiny? It wasn't quite enough, it was it, to really... Standing by. And I would feel so bad about not taking that All shot. All I need is a clear shot. Yeah, you will take that shot with armor breaker in full fucking accuracy. How about that? Attempting to acquire target. Hold on. <laughs> that's a joke. Oh man, that that's painful, really. Okay. Let's do this. Well, got to hit at least. Come 
Come on. There we go. Well, if he moves, he's gonna die. How about that? Okay. So the goo is coming. Oh shit, that's... Alright, he moved, so I'm not really expecting much there. Okay, go. And then we got this guy's... Oh! Another one. Would have been nice to get that shot. Oh well. This is all perfectly manageable. Is there another one? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, so grenades on, on all of them. They just took his arm off and they didn't actually... Uh, Can I? No. I'll get him next time. It's fine. Let's go grenades, boy. Using this to take down. Hmm. Now oh, fuck you. How about that? Get wrecked. Yeah, unfortunate, all things considered. Reaction shots and all that crap. Whatever. On it. How about a grenade that tar that hits both of them? Kills one. Yeah. Didn't like that, did you? No, we are not taking that shot. Hopefully he hits. Okay, one down. What's our move? You don't get the move, unfortunately. Yeah, that's a bit sad, isn't it? He is good, unfortunately. And I don't have any good options to take this guy down. That one is dead. This well, this one should be dead next turn. Yeah, he, he is. So what I'm going to try and do is... Take that one down. Do a quick save over here. Yeah, this one will do. I don't like that shot at all. I really dislike taking that shot. Identifying targets. Right, move over there. You are useless, good sir. Hold the 
position. Alright, goo incoming. And no problem really. There's no there's no more enemies, that's the thing about it all. That'll be pointed out. Use a bit of an armor break. Alright. Oh, she got two shots in. Did the reasonable amount of damage too with him. How about that? On my way. Alright, that's that would be a waste of ammunition really. That one's dead, effectively. Let's move over here, take out the other one. Or start trying to take down the other one. Zero damage, even with a laser rifle. Oh well. One gone. Now, one of the things I do absolutely need is yeah, is to try and heal her. We do have Pandoran layers to deal with over here, so I'm really gonna need All these guys set. to be, well, maybe not full HP, but would certainly. Well, then again, I don't necessarily need her. It's a lousy shot, isn't it? Targeting. Yeah, it's the cut. It's the. Ready to f Can we? There we go. Head destroyed at least. What's our move? Alright, 90 damage. I did. <clears throat> well, target. You're a lousy shot, you know that? It's not quite dead yet, but it will be next turn. All 
All right, she got the kill. Good. Progress. Well, Tiny is a bit injured, but that's fine. We can manage that. Okay, I uh, would like to eliminate these layers, honestly. Don't know how... Okay. Okay. Destroy the spawnery. Alright, so Tiny is coming. Tyler is coming. Jack, okay. Hold on. Yeah, get rid of that fucking lousy pistol. Put that one in. I'll leave one. Just in case. But I can scrap quite a few. Well, I mean, I also have the laser pistol. Hold on a second. So this is 60. This is... It... Yeah, this, as much as it pains me to admit it, the fucking greens have better pistols. <laughs> yeah, that just makes a lot more sense, doesn't it, though? So we're gonna take Silver Hood. Right, Jack. There is some ammunition I have for him. Uh, obviously, I need to continuously make more assault rifles, but that's a different affair. But for now... Just grab two of these babies. Alright, ammo is limited on these things because I just don't have the technology yet, but I will soon enough. So I am not taking Thomas. Let me see something here. Yeah, that makes sense. So, no Thomas, take Diana. Okay. I know, I'm taking a lot of my best soldiers uh, over here, but I don't want to screw around with this. Pandoran layers are not something you dick around with. Alright, let's go. It seems to me New Jericho has... the most damage. Let's get going. I don't have one guy with the fire roll rifle, but I can't really use that yet. I will soon. I would need to... Um, well, soon. I'm curious what... Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll see what transport New Jericho is willing to give me. And once I do that, I'll uh, figure out what my next decision is going to be. Uh, New Jericho should give me the transport uh, 
well, if not after this mission, then the one after, right? Yeah, third the next Pandoran layer. So I'm gonna need. Okay, two terror sentinels right off the bat, right next to each other. Completely fucking ignorable, I guess. Or maybe not, I don't know. Let me just save over Q and actually let's start shooting these things. These things really need to go down in flames. At least this one, I'm a bit concerned about this one. The other one, not so much. On the mark. I like that gun. Hold on. I guess it depends who I want to get the credit for this, right? I'd say Diana. Not enough. Okay. Zooming in. We that got does it. Them. Now, let me see. The layer is either there. It's got to be. I think I know the kind of rock formation to look for. I think I figured that one out at least. These layers are so fucking horrible, though, design wise. All right, we got what? Goo. Okay. Double time. Hopefully, it doesn't get alerted to our presence. Just yet. That's a, also a siren, isn't it? It doesn't know I'm here yet. Okay. Ready. Now I can't just yet. Now, this is gonna be a nightmare, isn't it? So, we got one. Siren over here with instilled frenzy mind control. I don't have an easy shot at taking out either of them right now. Moving now. Well, maybe the siren. I could start working on that. Tiny will need to move forward, and he will need to take that Moving. shot though. And the reason here, primary primary reason, is not so much to damage the siren, it's to eliminate that rock, but he didn't succeed here. in that, unfortunately. Time for the push. All set. Receiving lap. Taking aim. I'm here. We need to try and take this guy down. Oh my! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> That's bad. That is really unequivocally bad. Absolutely fucking atrociously bad.
All right. Uh, don't think so. You got to keep going. You and others. Pushing on. Ready to fire. <laughs> Take that. Good. How does He's that dead. Taste? Not now, but he is dead. Don't get me wrong on that. But that will leave the siren to deal with. And then, of course, we'll have the goo processor showing up. Ready to fire. Your shit, mate. Yeah, I gotta die. Pushing on. Identifying target. Okay. Moving. Not the most <laughs> ideal outcome, leave it there. Leaving it there, basically. She's not dead, but she's not gonna do anything for much longer. She might mind control one of my guys, but that's... Eh, she's not. Ooh, that was such a close call, really. On so many levels. That thing? Probably not, I don't know. Say that I need to be a bit careful here. Yeah, fuck the goo guy. Take down these guys. Quite eliminate them, but it will make some progress. Now, my hope, sincere hope, is that she's got. Yeah, she's dead. She's fucking dead, mate. All set. Now, I just need. Line of sight to get to all of them, basically. Zooming in. That one. Target missed. Rip. <sighs> Push 
pushing on. One down. That guy's either gonna move. Oh, another one. Crap. Two more. Shit. Well, we can handle this. Three more. This is the fun party. Tell me he's not gonna fire a fucking grenade. Yeah, he is. He's gone. Loud and clear. Right there. Confirming target. Another one bites the dust. Okay, let's take a look. Right, so we got that drowner over on that side, but that's not really the problem right now. Ready to fire. I can't afford to be good in, really. Do we have anything? Yeah, we do, actually. Armor break, Attempt take down the to abdomen. Would that work, even? Yep. This thing isn't working right. Moving now. Identifying target. Ah! 
that's a kill. Okay. Let me just save and try and find the bloody thing now. Because I don't know where the hell it is. Let's do this. Its arm is disabled. That's enough. For now. I don't know. I'm a bit out of options, really. Hold position. Sprinting. Target in sight. Eggs, eggs, eggs. Quite a lot of eggs, but no. Relocate. Bonnery yet. Where the fuck is it? Got to be quick. Another enemy has spawned, probably. I just can't fucking figure it out. Double time. Dashing. Not here. Clearly. Maybe here somewhere? Yeah, could be. Either way, Aiming. time to take down that uh, siren. Or at least weaken it sufficiently. be enough but <laughs> I just can't imagine it's actually there but could fucking well be right Comes online. Like, it could just be a trolley fucking game situation where the spawner is there no we would have seen it by that point so I'm going to assume it's not there. 
might be the worst assumption I'm gonna make, but... All right, end the turn. It's not gonna affect anyone really. They're too out of range. Well, I gotta admit, I did not think that would happen. No, you won't, you I damn fucking that. idiot. Let me try and figure out the solution out of this bloody mess. Well, that will do something. You know what? I'm not gonna take any chances. We're doing this at point blank range. Shit. Well, at least my guy doesn't have a reaction shot. Okay, so he does have a reaction shot. I was surprised that he didn't use it earlier, but all right. I don't know where that fucking thing is, so that's the problem for me right here. I've searched quite extensively, I might add. I've fucking searched, but where the fuck is the spawnery? It would be nice if the if the layout of the bloody layers weren't such a problem. You run around like a hellish chicken trying to figure out where the damn thing is. Okay. What's our move? Ready to engage. Still on target. Identifying target. Ready to fire. Yes. 
I'm here. I'm on my way. Taking aim. Threat eliminated. Time for the push. Could be here on this side, I think. But I don't know. Not here, not here. Where in the world? I'm ready. Just, yeah, it's kind of fucked up, isn't it? Like, I've searched far and wide. It's. I mean, it's, it's a structure of a certain fucking size. I'll check on that side. It, I doubt it's. It might be at the Terror Sentinels, who knows. These guys can't do shit, really. They're stuck because of terrain. Maybe I was wrong about that. Or well, maybe the Drowners can navigate that environment, but not the crabs. Sprinting to position. Alright, I'm gonna move these guys. No reason to get them involved in more combat against those enemies. The rest of them will just have to rush for the spawnery. Fucking frustrating, man. Holy shit. Run across the map to kill the thing. After finding it. It's a deep, dark corner of the bloody map. I wonder what citadels have. I'm gonna need to keep going back with my guys here. Alright. Online. 
Hold on. No rest for the wicked. Targeting. Confirming target. Hostile mist. Receiving loud and clear. Moving. On the double. Need some healing. Uh, just gonna finish this one. Ah, a siren in the sins. Okay. That will be enough. Repositioning. I'm here. Bonnery killed. Good. All right, a bit of experience. Tyler Wee Gunsmith has uh, leveled up as well. We got two injured, Zach and Ralph. But overall, mission complete. It would have been a lot easier if I didn't have to scour half the fucking map to find a bloody hatchery. But, uh, it is what it is. The Phoenix Project has done a lot of good for New Jericho, protecting our havens and assisting us with our plans. So, in the spirit of mutual friendship and cooperation, I would like to offer you this gift. I hope we can work together again soon. The plan is still far from complete, and I'm sure the Phoenix Project still has much to contribute.
All right, the time vault. At this point, Sam's notes become hard to make sense of. He seems to have investigated an archaeological site, okay. The writings of my great-grandfather recount his mission to Oglethorpe University and the time vault. It was here in 1936 that he deposited the files, sealed aluminium containers that were locked away to be opened in a thousand years. Did he know what those files contained? I'm not sure. He was a wily old devil. I have the documents before me now. They prove what I had previously only suspected. A technologically advanced hominin civilization existed on this planet long before Homo sapiens came along. They flourished until something destroyed them. But some of them must have survived. Or where did the stories come from? Somehow, they must have won. I know that some of my operatives think I've lost it. It doesn't matter. I have to keep searching. If I find the answer, it'll have all been worth it. So we got a proto-civilization. Maybe I could, you know, focus on that particular affair, but uh, anyway, let me check the bases. R&D, food production, energy, okay. Well, we have a good amount of resources, no, no need to waste them on shit that doesn't matter. So Manticore 2 is going to head back home. Oh, Manticore 1 should go back home. Can they win? No. Well, that's gonna be complicated, seeing as my guys are either injured or no fit state to fight. We can help New Jericho as much as it will piss Inedron off. I can't help them there. They're on their own. Costine here on Serious Gaming signing out. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned for more. The smart decision would actually be to deal with the lair. My guys are in pretty bad position though to deal with that. But, well, sometimes you gotta fight missions when you are not in tip-top shape. So, Costine signing out. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned for more.